Thanks for being here. I'm John Erickson with your NBC 26 News Update. Well, Bucks fans are excited for a new season and all that comes with it. A fresh start for a potential championship repeat after last season's title. The Bucks were expecting a minimum of 10,000 fans to pack the plaza outside Pfizer Forum for tonight's game. And this new season is also the first time the team has sold out of full season tickets ever. I'm excited about them getting their rings and I'm excited about just being at the game. And fans at, who are going to the game can expect to see some new things inside Pfizer Forum this season, including a standalone store with throwback apparel and some new vendor options and areas. And with the crowds at the Bucks games, I could say largely thanks to two-time MVP Giannis Antetokounmpo, a Greek journalist who's been covering Giannis since he came to Milwaukee says the city is a place Greeks hope to visit and see Giannis, the superstar, play. Time now for a check of our forecast. Here's Chief Meteorologist Cameron Moreland. Cameron? John, we had a lot of sunshine today. Temperatures were in the mid-70s, but obviously you can see some big changes are headed towards Wisconsin. We're going to have a strong system move across the state tomorrow into early Thursday. On and off, scattered showers and thunderstorms tomorrow. Wrapping up says some showers Thursday morning. Temperatures tomorrow, much cooler, mid-50s north, mid-60s south, but falling during the afternoon as gusty northeast winds kick in. Highs only in the lower to mid-50s on Thursday. Some sunshine by the afternoon with gusty northwest winds. And then quite cool here for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Below normal for a change, something we haven't seen in about a month. And along with cool highs, we'll have some cold lows. Several opportunities for a hard freeze, the first of the season. Have a great night.